Hey guys, ContactBuilder46 here. Welcome back to part 17 of Let's Play The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask. Um, Alright, there's a target out there, so we can actually get out of here. And... There we go. Gee, I was, I'm really bad at aiming in this game. I just cannot do that. Alright, so... Oh, Night of the Second Day. Oh wow, that owl, or that owl, that wolf sounded very distorted. But yeah, I think now that we got the, the water running, now we can, um, whatchamacallit, make this water wheel start spinning in the opposite direction like I was trying to do last episode before I realized that I was missing something. Oh god, no, 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 I did not mean to do that. Great, alright, well, I'll be right back. Alright, sorry about that little, um, issue there. Hopefully that doesn't happen again. Because that's pretty annoying when it does happen. Right. Let's just climb up here and, uh, use a water wheel to get back. I don't need to swim in there again. Thankfully, we're almost done with this dungeon. At least I think we are. I mean, we got the boss key already, so that's usually a good indication of how close we are to being done. for it and jump and of course I miss all right whatever I can just climb right here and this camera it's always doing stuff like that anyway we can just make our way right back up to this first room and if we see there's water pumping through here so that's good now it means um this like water spout I guess it's coming up no water spout. It's not like a tornado with water. Let's kill these. Th well, I don't even need to kill those guys. I don't think. Anyway, I forgot. Did I get all the fairies in this room? Yeah, I did. Okay. All right. So what I'm supposed to do is um, look shot here. Let's take off this. Well, I'll take it off later, I guess. Here and now we can reach it. All right, so that hook shot target is right above this water thing, so we can use that to um, get here. And now this is gonna reverse the flow of water. So what you're about to see. Oh wait, actually no, I think this is just gonna flat out stop it because now we have motion, like countered motion. So we actually can't do anything useful with this right now, but if we swim here and we turn off the other flow of water, or water flow, then we'll have water going in the opposite direction. I'm not sure if we can actually keep it not moving, I'm not sure what happens if that's the case, but yeah, now the water starts going the other way, so that's cool. Now we can have access to some of those other areas we didn't before because of... Yeah. Alright, now just wait here and we're out of the water. Whatever, I'll just collect these. I'll never collect them again. I'm supposed to go over this way. No, 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 no. Why didn't you just jump? What the heck? Nice. Alright. We can get back up here. And we gotta wait for that thing to go down. Alright. 
So if we look here, now everything's going backwards. So that gives us access to like... What the heck, I didn't even use this mask. It gives us access to like the other half of the dungeon. Or... Yeah. Alright, let's see. Alright, so we can go through here now. Ugh. So here's some mines and stuff. Whoa! Ah, dang it. Okay, I didn't mean to blow myself up. That's a skullfish. Right? Also known as a waste of time. Alright, I don't know why I was all quiet for a second there. But yeah, I'm supposed to be trying to find a way to get on here. Oh, oh! I thought this was behind the waterfall, and like I couldn't get onto it. But I guess we can, so that's good. Uh, let's turn that, or take that off. Let's uh, blow these up because it's faster, and we got some magic out of that, so that's always useful. Let's see, um, anything useful here? Oh, I remember this room. Uh, this is kind of annoying, actually. First things first, though, I forgot to check. There are stray fairies in this room, so I gotta be mindful for those. Uh... Oh my god, okay, I, I remember what to do now. But I gotta wait for this to go back up again. You probably have an idea for what I'm about to do now that you saw me equip this. You have to freeze this. But, when you do that... Um... I'm call it. But, you know, of course everything freezes, so you have to wait for it to be on top. So we can use this platform as a platform to get to here. Uh, of course the door was on the other side, but I'm pretty sure there's like a stray fairy or something around here. Uh, is the eyes of truth. I'm crazy. Know for a fact that oh yeah there it is. I'm supposed to get over there. All right, so we're gonna have to switch back and forth between fire and ice arrows because we're gonna have to be doing this. We're letting the water come back out. So yeah, so this platform could come over here. It's gonna be too late. Yep, it's moving. All right. Or maybe. I wonder. Do you think I could um jump from the? Do you think if I rode that, I can probably jump to there? Nah, I, I doubt it. Whoa! God damn it! All right. That's annoying as all hell. Fortunately, it doesn't take too long to get back up here, but I think there is a room that uses a similar mechanic later on in this dungeon. And it will be annoying, like more annoying when we fall down. Dang, I'm already saying it like I am gonna fall down. Wait for this to come up here and stop. And then I'm gonna. Oh, I don't think I can make that jump though. Of course we can. Because why would we? 
I'm gonna... I don't know what I'm gonna do. I guess I'm just gonna go around and just do what we're supposed to do and get through this damn door. I'll look up how to get this uh, fairy later, because I do want to have you guys know how to get these fairies if you're watching this, you know. I mean, obviously, you know, like, you could look it up yourself, but why would I do that? Why would I make you guys go through that? Alright, we've seen this cutscene like a million times now. Now we just jump here and carefully, ever so carefully, make our way through here. What's in there? Like a chest? Yeah, there's a chest, so we actually can't... Hmm. I'm just gonna see if I can, like, possibly hookshot it from here. I can! This is how you're supposed to do it, I guess. Well, that, that's a huge relief. Got a straight fairy. This is only the fifth one. Jeez. I really gotta be stepping up my game. Alright, so just before I have to go to the boss door, I am gonna look up how to get the rest of the straight fairies, and then I'll do that, and then fight the boss. Alright, so we're through here now. Oh, yeah. This is the room I was talking about where... It, like, totally matters. Um, what should I call it? It totally matters where, how you use these um, things, and it's gonna like totally make it mad if you screw up because you need to get quite a long way. I think there's actually one right above me. Yeah. Alright, because um, we actually need to get through here, because you can see it's actually covering up a hole there. So if we freeze that, or unfreeze it, rather, melt it, you know, then we can actually get through this hole. And, I don't know, I think there's something down here that's useful, right? I mean, I hope they wouldn't waste our time. This is just a barrel. Ah, but an important barrel, okay. Alright, well, I'm glad I did that. Because then I would have had to come back here later on. You know, those things can uh, live underwater like that? Okay, that's cool. Also, I wasn't supposed to melt that quite yet. How annoying. I have to um, freeze that again. I'm supposed to melt it while I'm on it so that it lifts me up. Ooh, what a gross sounding sound. Alright, now we can use this as a lift to get us up here. And then, uh, where do, where do we go from here? Oh, wait. <laughs> Duh, right there, of course. And then melt that so that this lifts us up. And, uh, this is where now you can see, like, what I was saying. Like, if you screw this up, it'd be annoying because then you have to do, like, two things. Or three or four things. I don't remember. Yeah, like, four things. And you have to, like, freeze them up and then melt them and then freeze them and melt them. Alright. Now, uh, I don't remember if there's still another fairy in here. There is. I really don't like that chew being there. Oh, of course he comes from behind. And, uh, I think Zora Link might just be tall enough to climb this. Yes, just barely. Alright. I have to carefully trudge our way along through here. Can't actually go in there or on those pipes, but we can get through here. And um, we got a hook shot our way here. All right. Cool. 
Ooh, we got a straight fairy. Was that it? Wait, what? All right, yeah, I guess that's it. Cool. All right, so we we done what all this room was meant for. Also, uh, ah, dang. All right. So there's just one more area we have to go through. Dang, uh, I'm sorry my commentary is really off. I'm not like talking as much, it's because I'm just thinking a lot right now. All right, so that goes up. Wait, is there some down here too? I had no idea. I wonder if it's something important. Oh, what, you mean that I could have literally just gone down here at any point? Like, right from the beginning? Wow, alright, well... I guess I did have to freeze that. I guess that was already available to us. But... Now I know, so... That's cool. Wrong one, alright, this one. And... Let's melt that. Alright, so we should be able to just jump through here and proceed. And we're back here again, okay. Oh, but this time though, the water is going the opposite direction. Ah, see, that's useful, alright. That's nice. Why is this so important the water is going the other way? Because now instead of being sent back to the um, beginning, I guess, now we can actually get somewhere when we go and jump to this current, because now it's going this way. We've got just one more thing to do. What's over here? Uh, why does this look so familiar? Wait, what? This is the room? Wait, what? Then where am I supposed to go? If it's not there. Oh, I think I get it. Ah, uh, dang. All right, I'll cut to where I'm supposed to, where I think I'm supposed to be. Okay, so before I found out what I was supposed to do, I found- I did a bit of research. I kind of found out why this platform is here. I mean, I probably can- I wonder if I can re- I can barely reach it from here, but there's a chest here. And, uh, we hookshot to it. Then, um, we got our other stray fairy. I think that's it for this room. Also, in my research, I found that I missed a lot of stray fairies. Which is no surprise, considering how I had, like, well, seven, until I got that one, which was eight. So, yeah, um, I'm gonna have to go back and get some. Fortunately, I don't think I have to do too much backtracking to get them, but, yeah, I'm gonna... There's actually one real soon that I missed earlier. I'm gonna show that in just a minute. After I get back to that room. Alright, so in this room... You guys remember this room. Um, whatchamacallit. There's actually something that I needed to get here. Apparently, I just decided never to break those pots. But, that pot has a stray fairy in it, so... Yeah. Anyway, you know, I just realized the time right now. I think I'm gonna end this off right here. And I'll get the rest of the stray fairies and whatnot in the next episode. So yeah, if you guys like this series, be sure to check out my playlist and um, watch we'll out for those videos. And um, yeah, if you like that, also check out my other Let's Play, which was Wind Waker. That's that one was kind of amateur, but I feel like I might have done a better job in some of those than this one. Then again, who knows? I mean, I'm supposed to be better now that I've done a whole Let's Play. I should have had a bit of experience, but it doesn't really look like that. So yeah, enough about that, though. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Hope you guys have a great day, and I'll see you later.